It is not death most people are afraid of. It is getting to the end of life only to realize that you have never truly lived. There was a study done, a hospital study on 100 elderly people facing death. Close to their last breath, they were asked to reflect about their life's biggest regret. Nearly all of them said they regretted not the things they did, but the things they didn't do. The risks they never took, the dreams they never pursued. I ask you, would your last words be if only I had? Hey, you, wake up. Why don't you exist? Life is not meant to simply work, wait for the weekend and pay rent. No, no, no. I don't know much, but I know this. Every person on this earth has a gift. And I'm sorry to the black community, but I can no longer pretend Martin Luther King. That man never had a dream. That dream had him. See, people don't choose dreams. Dream choose them. So the question I'm getting to you is, do you have the courage to grab the dream that picked you? That it fits you and grips you? Or would you let it get away and slip through? You know, I learned the fact about the airplanes the other day. Now, this was, this was so surprising. See, I was talking to a pilot the other day. And he told me that many of his passengers think the planes are dangerously to fly in. But he said actually it is a lot more dangerous to, for a plane to stay on the ground. I said like, what? How does that sound well? He said, he said because on the ground the plane starts to rust malfunction. We much faster than it ever would if it was in the air. As I walked away, I thought, yeah, it made total sense. Because planes were built to live in the skies and every person was built to live out the dreams they have in sight. So it is perhaps the saddest loss to live a life on the ground without ever taking off. See, most of us are afraid of the thief that comes in the night that steals all of our things. But there's a thief in your mind who is after your dreams. His name is Tao. If you ever see him, call the cops and keep him away from the kids. Cause he's wanted for murder for he has killed more dreams than failures ever did. He wears many disguises and like a virus will leave you blind and divided and turn you into a kinda. See kinda is dangerous, you know what kinda it is. It's a lot of kind of people you kinda want a career. Change your kinda want to get straight A's. As you kinda want to get in shape, simple math, no numbers to crunch. If you kind of want something that you will kind of get the results you want, what is your dream, what ignites that spark? You can kind of want that, you gotta wonder with every part of your whole heart. Would you struggle? Yeah, you will struggle, no way around. You will fall many times, but, but who's counting? Just remember there's no such thing as smooth mountain if you want to make it. If you wanted to make it to the top, then there are gonna be sharp bridges that must be stepped over. There will be times when you get stressed and things get depressed. But let me tell you something, Steven Spielberg was rejected from film school three times. Three times, but he kept going. Television actress fired Oprah, said she wasn't fit for TV, but she kept going, man. Critics told Beyonce that she couldn't sing. She went through depression, but she kept going. Struggle and criticism are prerequisites for greatness. That is the law of the universe and no one can escape it. Because pain is life. But you can choose what type. These are the pain on the road to success or the pain of being haunted with regret. You are my advice. Don't think twice. You have given a gift that we call life. So don't blow it. You Sometimes you gotta leap and grow your wings on the way down. You better get the shot off before the clock runs out because they know over time in life, no overdue. And I know I sound like I'm preaching on speaking with force, but if you don't use your gift, then you say not only yourself, but the whole world short. So what invention do you have buried in your mind? What idea, what cure, what skills do you have inside to bring out to this uni? Verse. Uni meaning one, verse meaning song. You have a part to play in this song, so grab that microphone and be brave and send your heart out on the live stage. You cannot go back and make a brand new beginning, but you can start now and make a brand new ending.